Hey guys, it's me, your best friend Joe. Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. Oh, you're just in time for me to click this button several times. <laughs> I refuse to use the wheel. I have a new gyroid that I buried yesterday. What is it? A bloopoid. Okay, that's wonderful. I'll have to find a good place for it amongst my uh, um, gyroid choir. We'll do that later. So I've been working on turning the village part of my island the place where everyone lives into kind of like um we put up some barbed wire fences we put up these uh metal rusted metal fences I, okay there's the secret y'all know that my the theme of my town is capitalism in motion and the half moon joe uh theme park on the other side of town is destroying everything else so you've got these little hints the, that's the Half Moon Joe logo on this bottle crate that's polluting the beach. Suspicious. So the rest of the town is really in shambles. I really, these fences really add a nice touch though. And I'm, if you have any trash and we're friends on Animal Crossing, feel free to send it to me. I always need more, I need more trash, especially tires, especially tires. Uh, and I'll eventually be able to remodel the outside of everyone's houses, right? Once I get to a certain part in the DLC. So then I'm going to remodel the outsides of their houses to match this side of town a little bit better. I think Ashley actually sent me the DIY for those fences. Uh-oh. Is she thinking about moving? Oh, overboard with shopping. A boa fleece. No, I just bought these curtains. Absolutely not. What a, an insulting request. Okay, let's go see what's in the shops today. And then I have been designing some really interesting houses. And actually, it's going to lead into the sub goal for this month is going to be... Oh, look at that T-Rex! The sub goal for this month. That's an electric chair. That's a, that's a fully an electric chair. I must have it. I must have it is going to be for you guys to pick the themes of uh, what I design, what I'm going to design. So um, tomorrow, the sub goal will officially be out. I didn't have time to plan it today. I'll take the dinosaur toy, though. That's cool, too. I'm about to remodel my basement, and that electric chair will come in just very handy. So I'll let y'all pick... Uh, the themes that I design houses for. That'll be the new sub goal for December, but we'll set it up tomorrow. And the subs today will count towards it. I'll make sure they get counted as well. So don't worry about that. Don't worry about it. I know we were all very worried. Okay, so I'm going to do some houses maybe, but I kind of want to show you all what I've been working on. I've been working towards getting my 33 houses done uh, so that I can redesign the houses on my island. And I think I've gotten them just right. I think I've gotten some... I think I've hit the nail on the head with some of these themes I've been given lately. Yeah, electric chair is now literal in the game. Lab chair. <laughs> but we know. But we know, Nintendo. But we know. See, I still really like the DLC. I usually only have been designing like a house a day. Because I've been busy and while I've been gone on vacation. Oh. She needs me for something. I've also been thinking about remodeling the cafe. Because the cafe I took a little bit seriously. And you know the restaurant we made. Chef Pietro. It was Half Moon Joe. Stop and Slop. So I'm thinking we should um, remodel it as well. Getting a promotion. Did I notice anything new? Is that a money machine for me? Automatic bell dispenser. Oh my gosh, Pokey too? A, B, and P, D. Uh-oh. I've been involved in one of those before. <laughs> I couldn't walk for a week afterward. But that's just a bit of a mouthful. Oh, you're telling me. I had the same problem. The relative that sent over the amiibo scanner also sent this. Let's you deposit Pokey. There's a limit on how much you can exchange each day. Keep in mind. Why would I ever want to deposit it? Can I have too much? I've already bought the deep fryer. I don't want the tractor. What is this? <laughs> That's 
what happened after my friend's giving. <laughs> oh, I love an LED display. Can I can I put whatever I want on it? I do need a short filing cabinet too. Thank you very much. And I have seen he's loaned me money before. Wardell loaned me money to buy something before. <gasps> drugs is what it was. It was drugs. I paid him off though. I paid him off. He threatened to break my legs though. It's really wild how realistic the DLC is in this game. What I come upstairs for? Oh, I was going to show you all the houses. HMJ LED display. The tr is the tractor really expensive? Because I might need to wait to purchase that. That's a... I don't have enough money for that tractor. And I know Wardell will loan me some pokey. But I don't want to use all of it for now. Let's just go to work. I'm ready to work. What other facilities do I eventually get to design? Because so far I've only done... Oh! She just said it. Having a hospital will give folks peace of mind. Not the hospital I'm about to design. You don't just design a hospital, Lottie. You have to hire, like, you have to have certified medical professionals. This is a science thing. Okay, I guess we're designing a hospital in this episode. Turn that down. Oh, that's better. Just a subtle glow. I can add, add the lab chair. We've arrived. This is the spot we reserved for the hospital. Let's start on the exterior first. Go ahead and work your magic. This was a mistake. I'm thinking making it look like something out of like American Horror Story... So all wood, definitely all like beige wood tones. Somewhere it looks like you walk in, you may not walk out. Oh, and it's the Half Moon Joe. <laughs> I should make the sign say exit only on the hospital. Moon landing staging area. Keep out. Let's do that. Let's put a keep out flag on the hospital. And you can't say they weren't warned when they try to go in the hospital. You can't say we didn't warn them. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Uh, baby Olives, thank you so much for the bits, by the way. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> this is a what? What's that? I don't know what things are. Thank you so much. Oh, I had a hazard sign too. Maybe I should have used the hazard. I like the keep out sign. It has blood on it. Is this okay for the exterior? Well, I don't know. Should I explore some of those other flag options? So we have the Half Moon Joe. It could just say coffee. We could just turn this into a coffee shop. Oh, we do have the biohazard symbol. No, I like the keep out symbol. It kind of gets to the point a little bit better, I think. Yeah, that's good. This is perfect for the exterior. This is wonderful. This is going to be even better than the restaurant. I can already feel it. Next up is the interior design. The hospital needs two areas, a waiting room and an examination room. To see what's needed in each area. Let me know when you're done. I'm excited to see your approach to designing. I just became a designer like a week ago and already I'm doing hospitals. Oh, hold on. Let me get these Nook Plus miles real quick. Perfect. Oh, I have some here too. Oh yeah, I've been getting the gyroids. Whimsical. I don't even know what it currently says on my passport. Alrighty, I am ready to design a hospital. I love this reception desk. Nice. Uh, this is probably a good size for the waiting room. 
We'll do the we'll do the sounds last. And it's gonna need to be dark, but we'll fix the lighting later as well. So what did what did they think the hospital needs? A counter and chairs. Not the poopy chairs. Is this a oh these are the these are the hemorrhoid chair? <gasps> Which I've had hemorrhoids. No hate. No hate to the hemorrhoid chair. Those things help. That's a butt chair. That's a that's a butt grape chair. <laughs> no, where's the meat grinder? Oh my god, I do have access to the lab chair. Okay, first thing we need to do is the walls and Yeah, here we go. It's already got like the worst wallpaper. They are, they're trying to outdo me. This already looks like a depressing hospital by default. They have the operating room wall. We've got basic wall. That's a little too bright. Um, but I think the, uh, I think it needs to have some kind of like 70s kind of wallpaper for the, uh, for the waiting room. This is it. It's the wood paneling. I already know. I already know it's the wood paneling. Now, is this a rubber floor in case anybody barfs or poops? So, operating room flooring we'll use in the other one. Restaurant kitchen flooring. No, no, no. That's actually really hurting my eyes. Why is my touch ID not working lately? Make it overly happy and then overly dreary. <laughs> that. Y'all, I only just recently learned that BBL is Brazilian butt lift. Is that what y'all say? Isn't that really dangerous? Rubber flooring. That's what I'm looking for, for the poops and the barfs. But there's also that reception room flooring. Lobby flooring! Oh, I think it's that. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Fast food flooring? <laughs> okay, they do have a dark wood version. I'm thinking that. Just, just brown. Just, yeah, 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 yeah. The theme is wood. Wood is the theme. Now, what does it think for chairs in here? Oh, you gotta have a magazine rack. Oh, a gurney. You gotta have a gurney in the waiting room. Just in case someone comes in and they need a gurney. The gurney. Examination room desk. Where's the desk where they reject all of your insurance? Because this hospital's in the United States. Where's the desk they sit at when they tell you they don't take your insurance and it's going to cost 20k to even walk into the doctor's office? <laughs> <laughs> Fluorescent lighting. Fluorescent lighting only. Out, it's an out-of-network only hospital. Only out-of-network. There's actually no networks that this hospital is in. You'll have an easier time finding an out-of-network. There we go. And definitely some, like, pretty artwork. Probably this breaker switch. Man, they recommended a lot of, like, kind of sketchy things to me, honestly. Did they recommend, like, a typewriter? Probably an IV drip, just because some patients aren't really going to make it back, if we're being honest. Sometimes you just need an IV drip. 
Oh, this is a Half Moon Joe brand hospital, by the way. So we're going to have a pink. And it's going to have the Half Moon Joe logo on it. On the desk. We should have a sign that says, I don't know, what's like a Garfield quote? Monica, thank you so much for the eight months. I appreciate that so much. Wonderful to see you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that so much. And Ryan, thank you for the bids. Even cleaning up the poo from when you find out your insurance was declined. Oh, God. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Wall fans only. There's no air conditioning in this place. There's a single wall fan. Uh, this waiting area... Waiting area will be over here. This is for the patients that might not make it back. We're running out of room at this hospital, and so... There's an IV situation over here, just in case. And I, maybe I'll put a rubber mat over there. Yep, sitting in the waiting room with an IV drip. That's the move. We need an old-fashioned phone for the desk. So I'll find that. Or just some butcher knives. Um, let's see here. And it should be play. We should have music and it should be KK Dirge. Oh, not even a phone. Let's just do stacks of doc. This is this this document stack is actually a stack of insurance rejection forms. Or these are the films you have to for out, fill out twenty times every time you do go to the doctor. That too. And they're sitting in probably a counter chair. I don't know what kind of chair to... They probably... Oh, yeah. They sit in this office chair, of course. <laughs> A big stack of insurance rejection forms. Oh, yeah. There needs to be a... There needs to be a gift shop. We got to have a gift shop. <laughs> Not the gift shop. All right, chairs for them to sit in while they wait. So when I think of doctor's office, I think of those really awful plush chairs they always try to have. But then sometimes it's just like these chairs. I feel like it's a lot just these chairs. These are like, oh God, do you know what these are? These are like church chairs. These are like church chairs. Fellowship Hall chairs. I am getting so much. Okay, we got to get rid of the windows, too. This place doesn't have windows. That's much better. And then, and then probably like an, a really old spooky couch. And then some screens on the walls that... Some TVs on the walls that is... It's not... You can't see it from any direction. No matter where you're sitting, the TV is uncomfortable to look at. Uh, this vintage sofa is pretty close, actually. Actually, this probably in brown. With... Let's do the dark brown fabric color. I don't know, that dingy was pretty good. Arrows on the floor! Oh my god. Air like, uh, social distancing arrows that nobody is... Uh, paying any attention to. Listen, this is just a southern experience. This is the southern... The southern doctor... The American doctor experience. Garden table. We need a really cheap looking table for the corner. Probably the wood table would be fine. But what colors does this come in? Oh, you can't... Oh, you can change the tray. Oh, yeah, that's the one. That's got some flowers on it. 
I guess I should maybe turn this this way. We'll put a TV on the wall. Kind of an enclosed waiting area. Waiting areas are always so bad. I and mean, we might even take out this chair. There's just enough for that much. Yeah, that's better. And we'll put like a... Oh, isn't there a water cooler? Isn't there a water cooler thing? Water cooler would be really good for this. Water cool now what is that? A powder room booth? Oh, we will need some of these separators, a hospital screen for the people who for the folks who don't make it to the back. Definitely this pink color. There is a water cooler, right? Or am I totally making this up? Maybe I don't have it unlocked yet. Oh no, here it is. Perfect! The white water cooler that they always have. We'll put a small table and then like a, with some magazines on it and then a screen on the wall. They always have this plant. It's this plant and it's doctors always have this plant and it's always plastic. It's just microplastics are just swarming into the air. Perfect. This is, this is so good. Oh my gosh, I'm here for the fest. Thank you so much for the eight months. I appreciate that so much. Keep those scoots, scoots, scoots going in the chat. Great to have you here. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that so much. A low rattan table or the folding table, probably the rattan table. It comes in some really awful wood colors. Oops. Yeah, this was always the move. This was the... <laughs> God, it looks like the funeral home your mom worked at in the 90s. Ah! Not the restraints on the gurney. Do they have like a... Here, a wall-mounted TV, but like the smallest one, of course. And we need some magazines to go on top of it. That's too high, but that's realistic. We need some magazines. It's a highlights magazine. It's a highlights magazine! If you fucking know, you fucking know. Oh, the lab chair is going to be in the surgery room. Don't worry. Oh, no. It's a Half Moon Joe propaganda magazine. <laughs> It's a Half Moon Joe propaganda magazine. And then a picture, literally, I mean, it's always a picture of a, of a flower. Oh no, it's this picture. It's a pregnancy picture. No, nah, we'll do the flower. If you're, I mean, if you're at the doctor in, if you're at the hospital in Arkansas, that's like a, that's a quote. That's like a, a scripture. It's a scripture quote in a frame. Pizza Cult 666, thank you. We got a first time sub. I appreciate that so much. Keep those goods, goods, goods going in the chat. Thank you, thank you. We've got these plastic lilies in the corner. Orange uh, or yellow, a really annoying color over here in the corner. I think I triggered myself. I think I've triggered myself. <laughs> I think I triggered myself. Oh no. Now is there a is there a rubber mat? Oh, this argyle rug. The exercise mat is No. We'll leave it on the carpet, and we'll put some stains on the carpet, too. <gasps> they dropped you? Did you sue? 
Oh, the sliding toy. The greasy sliding toy that is literally in every single hospital. When you, if you know, you know. If you know, you know. Oh, Space Trader, welcome, welcome. If you know, you know. I don't think they have that slidey toy, unfortunately. They have a chemistry set. Oh, they have a first aid kit. We're not going to use that. Oh, a box of tissues would be good. But I've run out of room. Yeah, we're pretty good. Maybe just a bucket of fish. Oh, here's some toys. Oh, a puzzle! Actually, a puzzle might be good. And the blocks? Oh, the, the box of toys, kids, that are just disgusting. The disgusting box of children's toys in the corner. Oh, there's a gift shop at the hospital. <laughs> Let's turn him that way. So what should go here? I'm, I'm kind of at a loss of what to put over here in this corner. I can smell this room. You want the gift shop over here? Not a salad bar. You want a gift? Y'all really want a gift shop? A Half Moon Joe gift shop? Okay, let's see what we can do. Oh, wait, maybe they sell some. We sell some toys too. Can you customize these with? Oh, but oh, this probably. This is something they would have in a gift shop. A doll. And it will be HMJ merch, too. I do have some signs and stuff. I had a... I have, like, a... It's a bunch of folded shirts item that I just recently got. But I don't know if it's unlocked for this. I don't know if I can use it for this. Yeah, I think I would have seen it. Yeah, that's just them. The wooden duck? Not a coffin shop. Golden Raisin, thank you so much for the eight months. I appreciate that so much. Keep those skus, skus, skus going in the chat. Thank you, thank you. We might need a full-on shelf over here. Let's see what, um, see what we have for merch. This meeting room table might be good for merch. I'm just exploring my options right now. Just a folding table, honestly, but I think I prefer something with wheels. Yeah, that's too low, too. Yeah, I think I prefer something with wheels for the merch. So I'm going to have to be Joe. I'm going to have to be me, my stem, I think, in order to hang these on the wall. It's unsettling actually being in the room and experiencing it. Experiencing it. So we'll do hats and sweaters on the wall. Nice. And we'll probably put those out too, though. Where's the hat? Is this a hat? Okay, that's a beanie. Okay, good. Hey, Shelby! Yeah, this is the hospital. We're designing a hospital. Can't you tell? Maybe these should go. Maybe these will go. Well, shoot. I want those to be visible. I want you to be able to. Maybe the hats go on this wall. Yeah, we've got a whole other wall for stuff to be on. Gotta remember that. Gotta remember that. We'll put some blood on the floor over there, too. So what actually... Got, maybe I, I do need the low table. I need a low table. Mm -hmm. 
The hospital you work at has a pharmacy in that. Wait, that you there's actually a gift shop in your hospital. I guess there are gift shops in hospitals often. I wish that were smaller. Let's see if there's anything smaller that I can brand. There's like mugs and stuff I can put the Half Moon Joe logo on, I think. If you have any ideas, let me know. Oh, you did miss a little bit. Uh, it'll It's in the VOD though, Shelby. Wasn't too much Arkansas hot gossip. I'm saving a lot of it for the podcast. I guess that's true. I guess they do have gift shops. I don't think that I have balloons. I don't think I have access to the balloons. We can sell fish and milk. Y'all want the whole experience. The whole experience. Oh, the mug. The mug. Does anyone still have the link? Justin designed this mug. It's a doll that his grandma or great-grandma has. Yes, thank you so much, Shelby. Not essential oils. Wait, can you brand the magazines? You can brand the magazines. These could be a stack of Half Moon Joe autobiographies. <laughs> That's the ticket. The Half Moon Joe autobiographical experience. Oh, don't worry. I got the link. I can paste this link. There you go. Don't you worry. You said you didn't need it, but I got it for you anyway. We've got... I mean, there's always candle warmers. People fucking love candle warmers. Such Can you customize the fucking puzzle? Ah! It's a Half Moon Joe puzzle! <gasps> Just absolutely. Just! Well, what about this? No. Oh. The beach ball? No! Darn it! Oh, what about this? I was gonna say Half Moon Joe nesting dolls. Is this just a book? Oh, oh, there's a pop-up book! I love things that pop up. I love three dimensions. I love all three dimensions. <laughs> the dog went bald. <laughs> Lit when it oh, I do have the shirts, the stack of clothes. That's perfect. Okay. I wish they had heat changing mugs. That would be cool. Okay, so the the bunny will go over here. This needs to go with the rest of the clothes. Um, let's duplicate the table. Please let me. Thank you. On this table will be the bunny. And the Half Moon Joe puzzle for sale. And I don't know, just this, just this, just an ugly plant in the corner, right? Just an ugly plant in the corner. This could stand to be. This needs to be scooted out one more. Or a mannequin. It could be a mannequin in the corner. I know, I gotta get to, I'm very close to 30 houses. I'm at 20 something. So, you know, maybe not close, but potentially close. So let's put, oops. See if we can put a mannequin over here. Now there needs to be a table out in the middle too though. What can go here? I wish there were a, I, I have a sign. I'll see if I can get the sign object. Okay, let's put down the mannequin. Probably modeling this one. This is our most popular hoodie. Out of the two. <laughs> Out of the two that we sell. Or I could just have the have two mannequins sitting out here. In the middle. 
Can you fit the fl the flower case? What's the flower case? Oh, you mean like by buying flowers? Well, you don't buy anyone flowers who gets who comes to this hospital because they're already dead. By the time you get here, they've passed. <gasps> I just heard. Did you hear? I just heard. <laughs> Oh, the CPR dummy! I haven't seen the CPR dummy in my objects, actually, so I don't know if it's here or not. <gasps> I just heard. Did you hear? Oh, I just heard. Not customize the urns. Oops. Unfortunately not, but selling urns is not a bad idea. We should just have a wall full of those urns in the back. This is actually a crematorium. Okay, I'm just looking for some ideas for... We need something like in the middle, right here. Or something, a sign. I need to look for a sign. Oh, they need one of the, they need a copy machine to print, to make scans. Everything is Half Moon Joe logo. <laughs> to make scans of your insurance card, even though they don't accept it. They do not accept your insurance, but they will take five scans of your insurance card and forget to give you your identification back. You will not get your ID back. You will have to ask. Oh, here's some sign. Oh, a small LED sign. But I think this poster stand would be good for the gift shop. <laughs> Did you hear about her cuss awfulness? <laughs> oh no! Rick, thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that so much. Keep those scoots, scoots, scoots going in the chat. Thank you, thank you. Oh no, that interferes with that. We'll put that over here. The person is... The person is over here, but this is also where you have to use the copy machine. That's fine. Oh, it's double-sided. Oops. Put that. Yeah, that's good. And then maybe this just goes, like, right here. Shows that it's the gift shop. Shows that there's some bargains. Maybe I'll put one mannequin with a sweater right here. I'm not satisfied. I need to... You gotta work on it till it's satisfied. Oh, the backpacks have to be on the mannequins? Mm. Not a bucket of turds and a mop. Is that here? Oh, we gotta put that in the corner. Thank you so much. Thank you for reminding me. And thank you for the bits, uh, Miss Sorry. I appreciate that so much. What's the worst? Oh, that's dingy. Alright. The mop for the carpet. That's fine. Maybe... Hmm, I'm torn. I'm torn. Because this would go better over here. Sometimes you just gotta mop the, mop the carpet. Maybe we don't need this printer. I mean, it just fits in so well, though. Alright, let's move the fan. Make the fan higher. Fine. Don't need these urns. Don't need that. We'll have a welcome mat of some kind. A, a rug right here. Maybe the Argyle one. That'll really split up the room. That'll really split up the zone. That really ugly Argyle rug. So that already. That helps create. That helps create a space. That helps dele delegate the space of the sections. A rug. A rug on carpet. And don't even at me for putting a rug on carpet. 
You designed Goldie's house on your island. She instantly asked, she should move away. Yeah, I hope you did it like this. This will be a sign that says, like, the gift shop's over here. Gift shop is over here. I'm just not fully satisfied. Don't worry. We'll get there. We'll get there. A stadio meter? I didn't even know what that was. We're not putting the salad bar. There's all these creepy things down here. Like, space. Oh, uh, floor sign? Floor sign. On the carpet, once again. I don't know, it's looking pretty good. They, the, a gumball machine probably would be fine. Oh, I don't know. We had that in the restaurant. We don't want it to be too samesy. Scarecrow, wheat, hand washing. Nobody washes their hands at a hospital. I have bunny day balloons. I don't have regular balloons, but I have bunny day balloons. Which is terrifying. Okay, I'll just do one more mannequin and I think we'll be good. I can't do the bunny day balloons. I'm sorry. It's just not something I can handle. All right, and let's go ahead and put this blood down, and then I think I can move the blood. That That's going to be moved. Don't worry about it. So the blood. All right, now we can move that. Just kind of peeking out from around the... Oh, yeah. Okay, that's a good gift shop. Now I believe it. Now I believe in the gift shop. I believe in the gift shop. The gift shop turned it out a little bit. We still need some stuff on the walls over here, but... I mean, I don't know. I think we turned it. I think we really turned this out. Okay, some inspirational posters. No air conditioning. Maybe a breaker switch. It wants me to put that on the wall. That's concerning. We're over there. That wall's taken care of. We kind of need a picture right here. Something with flowers on it. Probably this. What are we... What's the joke? Yeah, flowers with the wooden frame is... Kind of perfect. And then probably something right there. For when you gotta cut the power on life support. <laughs> I mean, the electricity in this hospital is kind of shaky anyway. Kind of shaky. I mean, the bulletin board might be good. Doctor offices have bulletin boards occasionally. With Half Moon Joe propaganda on it. Oh, it was highlighted earlier. Sorry. I When I get too into it. A baggage claim, but for urns? Let me tell you, when we were, when we were at the uh, airport, Justin took so long in the bathroom after the flight that they just left our baggage at baggage at the baggage claim pickup. They It had been on the rolly thing for so long, they took someone took it off and just set it on the floor. And I was like, Justin, you gotta hurry. I said, Justin, you can't take this long. We gotta get our baggage. I mean, no, 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 no. He, he was like on Twitter in the bathroom. He wasn't like pooping for 20 years. He gets on Twitter. And I said, Justin, I wanna pick up my baggage. <laughs> Sorry to my husband. Sorry to my husband. <laughs> oh, lighting now. We gotta get the lighting right now. 
Uh, I think it has to be fluorescent. I think we have to use fluorescent lighting. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my god. You have to... <laughs> you have to shuffle around everything. God. He was on Twitter! I was like, Justin, we gotta get our bags. Good God, this is a small examination room. All right. Let's light this up. So we're gonna do... I mean, at least like an eight by... At, at least a six by eight. I don't want it to be too big. We'll see what we have to work with. God, this is depressing. Well, I texted, let me tell you, I am the worst person to fly with, and Justin's kind of a saint for doing any kind of travel with me, because we, um, okay, so we're at Arkansas, about to fly back to D.C., and it's like, the announcement comes on at our gate, Justin's like, oh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom, and I'm like, ugh, it's like two minutes till boarding time, they're always late with boarding too, but I was like, okay, but hurry up, you know, we're about to board, and, um, they start coming on, saying how it's going to go, saying like, oh, boarding is going to be this, 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 this. And I'm texting him like, they're boarding! We're getting on the plane! You have to come back immediately! <laughs> I see him like five more minutes pass. They're not boarding. But I'm sorry. I'm glad you got to be here. Uh, five minutes pass. Still not boarding. And Justin, I see him just moseying as slowly as he can back from the bathroom. Because he knows I'm... Because he knows I'm a dumb dumb. I'm like, we gotta be here. I'm the one standing. I'm standing up at the gate. We gotta be there. Okay? It's time. And I'm getting on that plane. <laughs> oh my god! No! Let me tell you about the motion sickness glasses. I forgot to bring them. It's the biggest regret. I forgot to bring the motion sickness glasses. Guys, I know. I was so upset when I realized. I realized right as soon as we got on the plane there. Because I was so excited to tell y'all if they worked. Oh, da the damaged one. All right, let's sort out all of this stuff. I'm actually kind of thinking this room, this, this is, we're mixing vibes here and the vibes need to be sorted before I can continue with this room. We need to sort the vibes. Because this might be like a, oh, that's the vibe. That's the vibe. The, okay, we're getting the vibes. The vibes are getting better now. The vibes are getting better. Is there like a moldy wallpaper? There is that, but I think it needs to be just like white or mold or basement? Retro restaurant? I know, I had one job. I'm gonna have to, I'll get in a, well, I'm flying up to Kansas here in like a month or so, so I'll be trying them again. The nausea from that, or the nausea from being in Arkansas. That's fair, that's fair. That's fair, that's fair. That's fair. Where's just like a... I know there's a moldy wallpaper one, but I don't know if I have it unlocked. That's close, but it really doesn't need to be a tea room. And that's just too bright. Who wants an operating room to be bright? I mean, this is... To be fair, that one's pretty good. Where's the dun... I don't have the dungeon walls. I mean, we're gonna have to make do. We'll make do, y'all, okay? No. <laughs> I like to do my surgeries in the dark. I mean, it might be that one. That might end up having to be the one. The black perforated... Black perforated board wall. 
But I'm not opposed to that either. Oh, or just actually, I mean, that's too much tile though. A common wall. All right, so, so something we got to do is we got to get rid of the windows. We're not going to be windows. That's not the move. The move is not having windows. Nobody wants to be having surgery and someone look in the window. And someone peek in the window. I don't know, kind of like that too. It's a little too shiny. But it's kind of the vibe. It's kind of retro. Is blood stained concrete? I actually don't know. That's a good question. Oil does. <laughs> it's looking like the saw bathroom. What? Y'all, I don't know where y'all have gotten y'all's previous surgeries done, but this is always what it looks like. But this is always what it looks like when I've had any kind of work done. It's just on a rooftop. <laughs> All right. So far, my favorite is the dark tile. Well, it could just be green. Oh my god, that makes me nauseous. Oh, it's this. Is it this? It's this. It might be. Th it's this. This is the move. Okay. Okay, hold on. Let's get everything sorted. I don't really want any new looking machinery. So if it's a new looking machine, I may get rid of it. Does this come in a darker color? That comes in black. That's terrifying. That's actually like a village. Y'all see what that is? That's a freaking villager. Now custom design. I don't think I really want this to have the Half Moon Joe logo. It could have one of the dead villagers, though. Jerry. <laughs> Just blood. Just blood on the x-ray. We've performed your x-rays, and we have seen that you have blood. That there is some blood in your body. We did perform the x-ray, and we saw blood. Hey, Marianne, how's it going? Not kids' room wall. So I want that, I want that other dead. That other chair was a lot better, the metal one. This one. In green, please. I don't love this table. We may end up switching that up because I don't like that it has a computer on it. We don't really have technology at this hospital. Like this. That's technology that we just don't have. Pills we do have, but that does need to be in like a... Something like that. Do I get to assign a doctor to this? Can Pietro also be... The doctor? The green was pretty good. Oh, yeah. Computers are gateway to sin. You said it best, you know? If you make him the doctor, his job will be replaced by someone. Aw. We might make him the doctor anyway. I just, I just feel like Pietro might be a really good doctor. If you know, you know. We gotta have breakers on the walls in here as well. We'll eventually have a phone in here. Well, actually, it'll be the old-timey phone that we put in here. We need some old-timey looking machines and medical instruments and whatnot. But like this. Like, this is a computer. This is a comp- oh yeah, the damaged one. That's a computer, but that's like a sad computer. You know what I mean? What? 
That's like not a real computer. That'll go there. And I can go there. Or... Yeah, this is looking good. Old timey cash register? Ah! Ah! Not the old timey cash register. Okay, this is, it's going good. It is going good. I don't like this robot arm. That is like the vibe, but I just. I don't like it for some reason. Oh, knives on the wall, probably. Um, all right, let's just go look through everything. They're not showing me everything, and I need to. I need to see everything. Are there any drains? There's a manhole cover. I don't remember if there's any drains. Let's look. Let's look through everything piece by piece. And if y'all see anything that jumps out or screams like ah. Someone died here. <laughs> then let me know. Then let me know. I'm very upset I don't have access to the CPR dummy. I do love that table. It looks very surgical instruments on it, maybe. This desk might be better than that desk in the corner. If I could find something interesting to put on it. I don't know if I have that. I have the CPR dummy. Oh, that is nice. I have the CPR dummy on my island, but I don't think it's letting me work with it yet, which is really annoying. I go this way? Yeah. That is better. I like that better. This can maybe go, like, right there. And there might actually... It might be nice to have two of these. One here as well. We move the... The pill cabinet is, like, a give or take. It could it could go away and probably be fine. The chair's gotta stay. The machine in the corner's gotta stay. The steel... Oh, the steel kitchen worktop. That's a good idea. Let's go look at that. And I do have that. Nice. That might be good for like over here. This side. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Let's keep one out and see what we think of it. Because I do like these tables. The tables give a feeling of impermanence. Oh, that looks good there. It's all about design. You know, design is my passion. You know? <laughs> they find a way. They make do. They make do with this hospital. Alright, where were we here? We got you the desks. We don't need beds. We got the bed. Dresser drawer. Now this might be good. The short filing cabinet would look good beside the desk. Um, office cabinet, we don't need. That's fine. The screen, we don't need either because this is already a private operating. Oh, a cage in the corner. I know exactly what this is. I know exactly what this is turning into. So the pill thing, um, I maybe no. I'll put a pillar there. Yeah. <laughs> Half hospital. Well, that's where the, that's like the waiting section. The waiting section. And then I uh, surely I've got some uh, beams. Got a brick beam, a conc oh, a concrete pillar. 
มาตีนัสอืม we'll try the brick one too or the steel if I can dye this a dark color that would be wonderful we might just need to dye this one black love a good pillar I have not been like I haven't been using the fake walls at all That's ass too. Brick might be the move. <laughs> Lottie just keeps nodding her head. It's very disconcerting. All right, I know, I know what to do now. I know what to do. I don't want anyone to panic. We just have to move a few things around. The desk will go here. Yep, yeah, y'all see what's happening, right? That's the Dunzo. We're going to move... We're going to center this over here. It's okay if it's not centered in the whole room anymore. We're going to make a whole section tool for it. Lottie... Lottie, Lottie is just... She loves this. She just loves my creativity, I think. She, she just keeps shaking her head, yeah. She said, yeah, that's good, that's good, that's good. I don't know. I think that might be a work of art. There's plenty of room to do surgery stuff over here. We got the table here. Kind of an empty space here. We'll design that. We'll see what the move is for that. Maybe a rug. Maybe a rug. <laughs> Maybe a rug. She's nodding because she's scared what will happen if she says no. Lottie, come on. The work of art. We should put some Half Moon Joe merch in here. <laughs> Maybe this needs to be moved over a little bit more and then... Just not sure what to do with this area. It's very complex designing a, designing a hospital when you've only just been designing things for a week. Very complicated. Oh, there's a breaker! There's a breaker. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. There is a, sw a breaker switch, right? Is it a wall item? Oh, we gotta have the knives on the wall. So those will go on the back wall. Oh, you mean this breaker. This breaker. I thought there was an actual switch, too, though. I thought there was an actual switch that you put on the wall. Oh, cameras. Maybe not. Bad times. Roll of toilet paper. Ah! <laughs> Put one here. The break. Well, the breaker should go there. One camera there. One camera there. It's a little lower than the other one. There we go. Probably a lamp over here. I'm not don't think I'm gonna need that. I wish there was a is there a gate that opens? You can't really make a door that opens in this game, can you? Unfortunate. Definitely unfortunate. We'll have well, let's start designing what goes on the counter. Um and on the desk. We're doing the desk as well. Oh, has Sam texted me today? No. I don't know when we're doing the podcast. <laughs> I don't know when we're doing the podcast. 
Oh, the film projector. Now this might make for a really spooky lighting situation. I don't remember which way it shines. Because I wasn't born in the 1920s and I've never used one of those. I am thinking a stack of paper or a, definitely a clipboard might be spooky. Do a live podcast on Switch? Maybe we will for like something one of these days. You gotta look at your, uh, the Half Moon Joe. Can nothing go on the, okay, stuff can still go on the desk. That's good. I'll probably put a lamp on the desk too. Typewriter, this is the technology I was talking about. Perfect. We don't need an oh wooden toolbox, that's for sure. Um, what's that? Spray paint? Electronics kit. These are just all surgery things. These are all the things you need for surgery. And then, does this come in like a... Mm, it comes in a green, but not quite the ugly green I was thinking. That's okay. Maybe the lamp might actually go there. So let's leave that off for now. Stack some money. Um, isn't there something like a pile of clothes that goes on the floor? I'm getting tunnel vision now. We got the urns. I might not do the urns. I don't know. I don't think the urns are the vibe anymore. Because now it's more like, oh, chainsaw. Chainsaw! <laughs> no! Not me putting a chainsaw in the hospital and Lottie just nodded. Microscope? What do you think we do in here? Science? You think this is a science room? Microscope? <laughs> you, think we, you think we're about to do some science? <laughs> no. Microscope would be good. Oh, this is the this is the type of light that's freaky. Lottie said that's the move. Lottie said that'll do. Typing up the reports. Maybe a rug over in that area. Maybe another, like, really ugly. Maybe even the same Argyle rug. Oh, we could have red brick or dark stones. Hold on. I'm just trying these out for now. Yeah, not that one. But that could be stones in there. Eh, it doesn't really fit. That's gonna And that's gonna cover it up if I try to put any blood on the floor. That didn't fit either. No champagne, no cocaine? A festive rug, spotted, cow print. Oh, I forgot to put one in the main room, too. We've got these white square tiles. I wish there were some rubber rugs. Something really ugly. I just need a really ugly rug. I know, a drain really would tie it all together. A simple, a simple brown poo mat. Or actually this really ugly avocado. That actually works terrifyingly well in this corner. We need something here. We need to sort of delegate that this is a different area. I wish there were an L-shaped desk, but I do have an idea. I do have an idea. Stay with me. I guess I could just do that. Oh, I did just do that. Is there a wider one of these? Uh, 
Did we finish looking through everything? I'm going to put this here because we might end up using this. There's the flames machine. Hmm. Hey, Rob, welcome back. This is a hospital. Oh, I have the glowing moss balloon. It's a hospital. Oh, that's a trash can. Scattered papers would be really good for over here. Scattered papers with the Half Moon Joe logo on them. Oh, those are huge. I thought that was going to be small. That could maybe go over... I thought that was going to be small. We'll think about it. Boxes. We definitely need the mop and bucket again. Um, PP machine. Skeleton might be good. Anatomy dummy might be good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't even see all these pipes. Pipes on the wall. Rusty pipes. And not a urinal. Not a pee pee machine in the corner. So there's this. There's a manhole cover. But yeah, it's not quite a drain. Workout equipment. A sled. A scarecrow. Tires. I think this tank is huge. I put, I've used the tank in another house, and it's freaking huge. Samurai sword. Okay. Let's work with what we got now, because we, ex we discovered some more things that might be of interest to us. We love the pipes on the walls. The mop in the bucket's actually pretty darn good, too. The phone could still technically go over here. I don't hate this setup. Because it is a small cramped office. Okay, would y'all rather have the skeleton or the anatomy dummy? I think the skeleton. I don't want to add it. I don't want to make it too, like, personal. Okay, I need to see something real quick. Let's turn on this projector. The projector kind of sucks. It's not doing what I thought it was going to do. Does it even show anything on the screen? No. Projector is out. The skeleton is an RN. Yes, yeah, I think skeleton too. Oh, oil barrel. That might be okay. Like a vat of acid. That's what I think of the oil barrel. Like a vat of acid you might drop somebody in. If you know, you know. Ah, that's so me. Do you know what I mean? That's just so me. <laughs> that is so me. If you know, you know. Just girly things. Maybe that can go there. That really rounds out the room. But it needs to be a color that blends in more since it is such a heavy presence. That's a little better. Actually, if I put that there, that could just go right in the corner. And then I could have some little thing right here. I don't know. I wish this skeleton went all the way back against the wall. Well, that area does need to be kind of open because you kind of need to see who's in there. <laughs> hey, Maya Soul! Thank you for the 17 months. This is a doctor's office. This is an operating room. Duh. Thank you so much for the 17 months. <laughs> Keep those goods, goods, goods going in the chat. And Captain Dada, thank you for the bit. Oh, yeah, the, the chair. I didn't see that. Sorry. The chair next to the machine. I think I'm going to keep the chair inside the... The thing for now and see what's up with that 
Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay, so we need something else for the table over here. And maybe it's a box of office materials that we need. We'll just have this out and ready just in case. Sewing stuff. Oh, maybe the lab. Maybe this old timey. I mean, I guess that's not really old timey lab equipment. So that's just that's just lab equipment. <laughs> and maybe the chainsaw. Well, that could go there. Thoughts? I have an idea. It's a very crowded room. I never said it wasn't. Chainsaw just on the floor right there. Okay, I think that's perfect. Let's put some stuff on the walls. Y'all really think there needs to be music? I kind of think there doesn't need to be music. I don't know. Oh, definitely the shower. Or like, if you accidentally... Remember, they always have these. So like, if you get chemicals in your eyes or whatever. Hillary Duff music, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind that. There might need to be a fan over here as well. I just love the green fan. I just think, I just think it's neat. Towels. Oh, my degree on the wall. Of course. Is that, that looks like a diploma. Some like radioactive, are there any custom signs I can put on the wall? Need some custom. I think you can customize these, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is perfect. So this will be like a radioactive sign or something. Oh, periodic table. That'll look really good behind that stuff. That's a good idea. Periodic table. Is that under the study? Is that study? Oh my god. Oh, God. Not that astrological table. Uh, something right there. Probably another personalized sign that says, like, keep out or something. Oops. Those should really have white frames, I think. Um, what are we saying? Staging area. This one could say private. Eh, it doesn't even fit. We'll do another toxic symbol. Oops. My fingerprint reader hasn't been working. It's very upsetting. <laughs> and that's on periodic table, sis. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. Uh, genius at work. <laughs> uh, and a, a wall clock would probably be good. I feel like doctor's offices always have the same wall clock that just ticks and ticks. Oh, and so you gotta mark the time of death, too. You gotta make sure you got- you mark that time of death. Once again, no, I just want to see what these look like on the walls. See, that would be okay there. Eh. No. Let's change that to a white border. Alright, let's see how it looks from this direction now. 
Oh, it's full up in here. Oh, you can't even... Ah! Ah, not the gay shuffle around the... Oh, you can't get through there because of the chainsaw. Can you turn on the machine? Oh, beautiful. Now let's turn on the chair, too. To turn on the chair, I might have to, uh... Can I do chemical stuff? No. All right. More ideas coming. Don't y'all worry. Let's just move this over here. So that we can turn on the chair real quick. <laughs> oh, you have to be sitting in it. Ah! Not me. Not this. Well, I'm disappointed it doesn't just stay on. All right, now we just need some blood spots on the floor. Just the electric chair on ourselves. Yeah, this is turning out really good. Okay, we'll move that around. Duplicate it a couple times. Give it the old spin a for realism. Um, I need my radioactive rug as well. So let's do that. Well, actually, we need a welcome mat in here. Just like a really ugly drain mat. Or not a drain, but a floor mat for the entrance. Simple green bath mat. That might be the one. Oh, that's a little too bright. Is there anything brown? Aluminum rug? That's huge! Dark wood flooring sheet. Well, balls. That machine is loud. Alright, we don't need a welcome mat. The office supplies, are they out of place? Do they look out of place? Should the office supplies go? Is it yay or nay to the office supplies? Hey, Anna Axe. Welcome. Glad you got to make a stream. Nay to the office supplies? Okay. Yeah, and that gives a little more room around here as well. And instead of that, putting that there, here's what we'll do. This is going to make it... No, 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 no. This is going to make it a lot better. We'll put the uh, toxic waste. Oh, move forward, sis. There you go. We'll put that in the corner, and that'll look better. Alright, now we need to get the lighting sorted out. So... Probably the concrete as the entrance. Definitely bright light, but like... I don't know, kind of... Not dark, dark, but probably like there. Let's experiment with some different walls and then that's it. And then I'm done. See, that looks good. I don't know, the blue looks good too though. Y'all think the blue? I like the blue a lot. I think the blue. Okay, I think I'm done with this whole hospital. Let's tell Lottie and she can show us around. I'm finished. It looks great. It looks like we don't have the necessary... Oh my god. Shut up she's gonna tell me there's i didn't put enough chairs in here did i because it's a waiting room the hatefulness of having to design for these fucking 
These fucking simpletons who don't know fashion if it hit them in the fucking face. <laughs> These fucking simpletons. Did I put a clock on the wall? I didn't even put a clock on the wall. We're not, we might need to put a, you know what, I don't care. But I do want to put a sign over here. I should have put a sign on this wall. These fucking simpletons. And their hatefulness. Oh, that's actually cool. Typography. Vintage. Actually, that's pretty cool. We need something over here by the gurney. Okay, that's better. Now, what the fuck does she need? Where am I going to put these chairs? What do you need? Ah! Ah! One more fucking chair. Okay. I could just put a stool there. Can I just put a stool there? A simple stool. Don't mind me. Just taking a simple stool. That counts. That fucking counts. Okay. That's what it is. A simple stool in a simple corner. If she's hateful towards me one more time. What? I was just in there and you didn't tell me that we didn't have everything we needed. You made me come back in here. And now I have to scoot my little gay ass around all this furniture. <sighs> she told me to eat shit. She's the first... Oh, what do we need? A doctor! What does she think this is? That's a doctor's desk in the corner, sweetie. Sweetie, what's that thing with the typewriter on it, sweetie? You're joking me. <laughs> hey, Annie Calzone. Well, you know, fuck me, I guess. You know? Because I guess you don't get to have whatever desk you want. I guess you have to have the desk that they want you to have. I can't even turn this around, this room so full. The hatefulness of this whole thing. Just hateful. I can't even put anything on this desk. Alright. Doctor doesn't get a phone. Is everybody happy? The doctor doesn't have a phone. And I think that covered up my diploma. It sure did! Upset. Part 2. Oh, and the typewriter, because we have a com we have to have a computer now. Everything's computers these days. Turns out Lottie was the one true hater. I know we could have a wall phone. I don't like wall phones. Oh wait, let me make sure this fan's not clipping. And X1999, well, thank you so much for the uh, first time sub. I appreciate that so much. Keep those skus, skus, skus going in the chat. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Let's decide who will be the working here. Okay, we need a doctor. Who's going to be the doctor of the hospital? Y'all, I just think it needs to be Pietro. I just think. Y'all, I just think that's the move. Now, as for a receptionist, it's got to be someone who really hates their life and also doesn't care about you. Alice? Is it Alice? Is Alice the receptionist? It might be Alice. <laughs> yes! That's the receptionist! All right. Let's, uh, oh, no, no, no. Change his outfit. Well, no, that's pretty... Oh, my God. Ripped doctor's coat. 
Not the ripped doctor's coat on Pietro. Yeah, that's probably that's probably about right. And what is oh <laughs> Stop! Don't do this to me! A chef's hat. <laughs> the chef's hat. He's gonna wear the chef's hat. Chef's hat and... <laughs> These right here. That's it. I don't know if the ripped one. These ones look better. Yeah, let's do that one. The red's too matchy. Yeah, that's fine. All right, Alice. Jeez, what kind of like asylum uniform is she fucking wearing? What even is this called? Nurse's jacket. She's not a nurse, though. No, she needs to be wearing... If she's a receptionist, she needs to have a sweater on. Like a cat sweater. You know what I mean? Like a grandma sweater. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. That's what she's wearing. And... Is there like a live, laugh, love? There is like kind of like a live, laugh, love shirt. She needs pants. Unfortunately, you cannot put pants on them. That sweater is it. It is so it. And then probably just like a flower hairpin. Probably the red one. And she's wearing... <laughs> I love these glasses. Why does she look so cute in glass? Oh, yeah. Oh, she's wearing a fun color like pink. You know she's quirky. That's it. Purple. No. The oval. That's it. That's it. That's it. This is perfect. This is fucking perfect. <laughs> That's you! <laughs> okay. We need to give our new hospital a name. No, let's give it a name. I can name this hospital right now. Alright, I'm gonna pick it up out of the switch. So I can type with my fingers. Ow. Ow. Okay, you're gonna see nothing on the screen for just a second. This is the half moon... Joe. It's an LLC. It's an LLC. The Half Moon Joe LLC Memorial Hospital. Oh, hospital won't fit. That's fine. Okay. You drop them, we slop. Oh, I should have put a blender in the back. Okay, it's the Half Moon Joe Limited Liability Corporation Memorial Hospital. Perfect. Limited li You always want your hospital to be Limited Liability Corporation. Okay? That's how you know. 
You definitely want to name it the Half Moon Joe Limited Liability Corporation Memorial Hospital. Sure do. Here we go. Welcome to the Half Moon Joe Limited Liability Corporation Memorial Hospital. Alice will be taking care of you today. You can get nice and comfy on our carpet on carpet waiting area with the Half Moon Joe merchandise section in the corner. You can get all your Half Moon Joe merchandise while you watch a 20 year old TV on the wall that is tuned to golf. Have some water, read some magazines that came out 30 years ago. And then we show you our beautiful operating suite where oh, <laughs> there is an electric chair in the corner and we have Dr. Pietro. Oh my God, they actually put her in the cage. Dr. Pietro is working hard to make sure that you have the best programs and medicine available. Don't let the chainsaw in the corner scare you because that's just there for fun as well as the knives on the wall. We have a state-of-the-art operational suite facilities here at your Enjoy Your Stay at the Half Moon Joe Limited Liability uh, Memorial Hospital. Did she just say she recruited some patients? She was out here breaking people's legs so that they could come to the hospital? Lottie just said she recruited patients! She was re Oh my god, it actually put her in the cage inside the, <laughs> inside the room, in the hospital. It put her in the cage, in the electrical chair. She's in the in the electrical chair. There is the blood on the floor. There is the chainsaw in the corner. I don't know. This is just what all the hospitals I've been to have looked like. And don't let it worry you that the doctor is also a clown in his spare time. It's good to have hobbies and it's good to have a life outside of your job. Oh shit, I'm stuck in the- no, 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 we're good. We're good, we're good. Not her on the stool by the gurney. I don't know, I think I turned it out. Oh! I need to take pic- do I need to take pictures? Why do I always miss calls during the fucking stream? What's up? Let's take that photo. Oh, we're gonna take the photo outside the hospital. Yeah, the merch section of the the Half Moon Joe merch section of the hospital. We're gathered here to take a special sort of heaven. <laughs> oh my God! I forgot the flag says "Keep Out." I forgot that I made the flag on the hospital say "Keep Out." <laughs> she wants me to say a few words. I'm gonna say, "I'm so happy." I always wanted to own my own hospital. That doesn't sound like a lawsuit waiting to happen at all. All right, let's take a picture. Everyone's, everyone say, yay, people are dying in there. Oh, can we do that one more time? Oh, oh it needs to be sepia, doesn't it? <laughs> this is the best thing of my life. This is the best day of my life. What do I think of the photo? The photo's freaking perfect. This is about to turn into an episode of American Horror Story. An entire season of American Horror Story. On Wednesdays, yeah, they do, we do, they do the C-sections like, like my mom's doctor did when I was delivered. <laughs> because of this, you were able to complete a hospital. Oh yeah, she got sick before this. $25,000! Dang, there's a lot of money in the hospital business. Do you want to call it a day? Uh, no, I'm finished. I just built an entire hospital. What the hell else do you want me to do? The hospital definitely has a group on. Definitely has a group on. 
It was this the hospital? That's the school. Oh, it's really convenient. The hospital's right around the corner from the school. Oh, God. What's wrong with everybody in here? If I talk to the people waiting to see the doctor, do they tell me that they're injured or something? What did Lottie do to you? Everyone's been so kind to me here at Half Moon Joe LLC Memorial Hospital. And I don't even think it's because of who I am, you know? I think they're just super nice. Yes! We're accepting of everyone in the LGBTQ plus community bubbles here at Half Moon Joe LLC Memorial Hospital. Uh, we're accepting of everybody. Uh, Bubbles is family. Not me walking into the doctor's office. And Pietro is inside the cage with Shino. What happened in here? What's going on? Can I lie down on the gurney? <laughs> I wasn't prepared. Like, I thought I was prepared, but I wasn't prepared. None of us were prepared. None of us were prepared for this. Oh my god, wait. <laughs> Not him just dumping on the table. I need to put on... There's an outfit. You can... Yeah, get out your axe. I don't think I can get out my axe, actually. Nope, I can't. Oh. You can switch who the patient is? Wait, if you get to choose who the patients are in your hospital, that means you're intentionally injuring someone to make them go to the hospital. This game is freaking dark. I'm telling y'all. This is dark, dark. Can I do a custom? Wait. Y'all aren't even ready for this. <laughs> oh God, he just T-posed. Oh my God, he's still holding the clipboard. All right, you go over here. <laughs> oh no! Can I change my outfit in here? Oh, I can. Is this just... Oh, I can change my outfit whenever I go to the hospital? Oh, I need to be wearing a doctor's uniform. Or, y'all, why does this game like this? This game shouldn't give me all of these options. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's probably the screenshot of the video, honestly. <laughs> oh no! My patient is broken. <laughs> this is the best game ever. Okay, well, uh, that's all for today. <laughs> that's all for today, I guess. Um, I guess that's all for today's video. Not protesters. Why are there protesters on a small island like this? That's what it needs to be. Petra's always there. Petra's always there. You know? I think it turned out magnificently. Okay, that's all for today because um, I might have to go record the podcast. I'm not entirely sure yet. Or... <laughs> Everything is pretty much horror themed on my island. On my island so far. 
But I think we really turned it out with this one especially. This one is, um... I didn't think we could do better than the restaurant, but I think we've somehow managed to do even better. Oh no, not this quote. <laughs> I still love that Pietro's wearing a chef hat while he's a while he's a surgeon. He's wearing a chef hat. Don't let that make you uncomfortable when you go in for surgery and Dr. Pietro is wearing a chef's hat. Oh, we'll get some good TikToks out of this video. I know it. I know it. Okay, I'm going to do the the outro music. A hat's a hat. What can you say? Okay. Let's do this. Oh, it's good to be back. Thank y'all so much for being here on my return to streaming after being out of town for a while. Thank y'all for all the bits, donations, subs, gift subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all keep these possible. Y'all keep these happening. I'll be back tomorrow with some Nancy Drew and we'll have the new sub goal. I'll let y'all know what that is. Love y'all so much. And um, I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.